Okay, so today's project is going to be to take my solar astronomy charity van over there for the Charlie Bates Solar Astronomy Project and somehow using my P-Touch label maker get all of this stuff to fit into it organized properly and I take this around to schools all year long and show students solar flares and sunspots and the point is to be able to get my stuff in and out of the van quickly and know which case contains which product so today we're going to organize and relabel everything with the new Pete Touch 2730 model label maker and some of their high quality uh, very durable tape and then we're going to test it over the next few weeks to make sure that it holds up to the pressure so that's what we're going to do today So changing the tape in the PT2730 label make, maker is just uh, fairly easy. Unwrap the new tape you want, and this time we're going to try the extra strength adhesive tape, white and a three quarter inch. All you do is take out your whole cartridge, put in your new cartridge, close the top, and you're ready. Let's go ahead and show how easy it is here. Standard pieces and print okay tell me my font is too large to fit on the tape so let's go ahead and go to text change my font to say 24 point choose okay and print now as you can see the label comes right out the side exactly like you want it and then it cuts it off and gets it to the right size and one thing you might find necessary on these labels is that peeling them is a little tough so if you fold it in the middle the uh, labels are all perforated on the back already or they're cut down the middle so it's easy to fold them and then pull off the labels like that and then when you stick it on, it's a really good idea to stick it on like that and just pull away as you're sticking it. If you do these things, you will very much enjoy the label maker. Okay, so I've labeled all the cases with two types of P-Touch labels. The larger ones are the normal labels that come with the label maker. They're standard 94mm uh, label. And the smaller labels here and here are what they call their extra strength adhesive labels and these cases are very very tough surfaces it goes from a solid sort of cardboardy surface to a dimpled plastic surface hard rubber uh, leatherette surface over here to what's a very heavily dimpled aluminum surface so we're going to see which one of these labels holds up the longest under rugged conditions because believe me i'm tough on these cases and i use them twice a week all year long at different schools and public events and these things get tossed around pretty heavily. So we'll see which one of these labels is more appropriate for this type of work. Now to pack everything up. Okay, so here we go packing up. And believe me when I say it, your life will not be easy as a label in my solar astronomy van. Tough life. Alright, so it's all packed up now. And next weekend is my largest event of the year, Dragon Con in Atlanta. Sci-fi fantasy uh, convention. 45,000 people. And I'll be dragging these cases and everything in this van up three elevator flights and then taking it out to a pool deck and setting it all up and then taking it back every night for four days straight. So these cases are going to get beat up bad. Life will not be good as a label in my program. So we'll see how they do.